Okay, in this video, we're gonna talk about how to differentiate exponential and a logarithmic function. So, let's have the first example. Okay, let's say we have y equals e raised to 2x. Okay, we know that the derivative of e to the x is e to the x. But for here, we have to use the chain rule because uh, the exponent is u, which is a differentiable function of x. So, dif to differentiate, we have a y prime equals e raised to 2x times the derivative of 2x, the exponent. So, y prime equals e raised to 2x times derivative of 2x. Is so, finally, our derivative here is 2 times e raised to 2x. Okay? Another example, let's say we have y equals 2 e to the x times x to the 4. Okay, for this one, are we gonna use the product rule? Okay. Recall that the product rule states that the derivative of u times v is just u b prime plus uh, v u prime. Or kahit magkabaliktad yung dalawa, pareho lang. So, we now have the derivative of 2e to the x times x to the fourth by getting first over u. So, it's a value of u here. u is equal to 2e to the x. So, therefore, its derivative is same. 2e to the x. So, the derivative of e to the x is e to the x times the constant. The 2e to the x. So, v here is x to the fourth. Therefore, v prime equals 4x cubed. So, we now have the derivative of the function. y prime equals u. So, our u here is 2e to the x times v prime, which is 4x cubed plus v x to the fourth times u prime, 2e to the x. So, therefore, we now have y prime equals 2 times 4, 8x cubed e to the x plus 2x to the fourth e to the x. Okay? Also, you can simplify this by factoring. Pwede siyang maging ganito. We have a common factor of 2x cubed and uh, e to the x. So, we have 8x cubed times e to the x divided by 2x cubed e to the x. So x cubed cancel, e to the x cancel. So 8 divided by 2 is 4. Plus 2 divided by 2 cancel. x to the 4th divided x cubed. That's x. e to the x divided e to the x here is 1. So that's the factor. So you multiply, you come up with 4 times 2, 8x cubed e to the x plus 2 times x cubed times x, so 2x to the 4 times x. So, either of the two uh, are, uh, is correct. Okay? So, what if we have this one? Uh, let's say we have 12 to the x. How are we going to differentiate this? So, y equals 12 to the x. So, that's very simple. So, the derivative of that is what? So that's 12 to the x times the natural logarithm of the base, which is 12. The rule, right? The rule here is a to uh, the derivative of a to the x is just a to the x ln of a. Okay? So what if we have y equals, let's say, 12 raised to 3x squared? How are we going to differentiate this? So simply, y prime is equal to, just copy, 12 raised to 3x squared times ln of the base, which is 12. But we have to differentiate, uh, to multiply it by the derivative of the exponent. Derivative of 3x squared is 6x. So therefore, our answer here is, uh, this one, or if you want, you can write it as 6x times 12 
base to 3x squared ln of 12. So that's the process of differentiating a general exponential function. Okay. So let's now have a uh, exponential, uh, logarithmic function. But we will focus more only on ln. Okay. So how about y equals ln of 2x. So that's very simple. We know that the derivative of ln x is 1 over x. So therefore, y prime is equal to a. Ah. So derivative of ln, ln of 2x is just 1 over 2x times derivative of 2x. That is so y prime equal to, we can now cancel, that is 1 over x. Okay? Another one, let's say we have y equals ln of cosine 2x. So that is simply y prime equals 1 over cosine of 2x times what's the derivative of cosine? Negative sine of 2x times derivative of 2x. That is Therefore, we now have y prime equals 1 times negative sine 2x times 2. That's negative 2 sine 2x divided by cosine of 2x. But we know that sine over cosine is tangent. Therefore, this is equal to negative 2 tangent 2x. Okay? So, let's have another one. Okay, what if we have x x the eight e to the x minus pi to the x. Okay. So that's very simple. We use the product rule here, then we use the the uh, derivative of the exponential function because pi here is constant. So y prime is equal to derivative of x to the 8, 8 x to the 7, copy e to the x plus x to the 8, derivative of e to the x, e to the x. Right? Reco uh, repeat. So x to the 8, 8x eight to the 7, copy e to the x plus x to the 8, derivative of e to the x is e to the x minus as a derivative of pi over x. pi to the x, that means pi to the x times ln of pi, right? So simply, uh, yeah, we just have to remove this because this is single term. So pi prime equals 8x to the 7, e to the x, plus x to the 8, e to the x, minus pi to the x, uh, ln of pi. Okay? So what if we have plus 1? Say we have uh, y equals e to the 2x over x. Or here we use the quotient rule. So y prime equals copy x, then derivative of e to the 2x, that is e to the 2x, derivative of 2x, that is 2. Minus copy e to the 2x times derivative of x is 1 over the square of x, x squared. So y prime equals 2x e to the 2x minus e to the 2x over x squared. Again, we have 2 times x, so 2x e to the 2x minus e to the 2x over x squared. So that's how to differentiate uh, exponential and logarithmic functions.